I can't believe I started opening this box. Not on camera, because I'm My, dumb. Mikey, yeah, Mikey hands <laughs> oh, me gosh. this box. He goes, nonchalantly, I started opening the box because I'm dumb. <laughs> Rip me. Oh, my god. your gosh. box, Mikey. All right, let's get this going. <laughs> Hello, everybody from Mikey's channel. It's Darium and Mikey. All right. So, Mikey's a bit slap happy, I think. Oh, yeah, it's funny. All right. All right, we're going to... Let's just, let's just, let's just... Do you want to do one at a time or at the same time? How we'll much do, how much we'll do you do, want to milk this for? Let's do, I'll open a pack and you open a pack. I open Go a pack. Go for it. Let's do it. We need to get, um... That jump Luff? Jump Luff. Jump we need luff. Jump Luffs. I couldn't think of the name for a second. All right, I'm going to share you, a few codes. I say, what do you want me to do with your codes? Oh, you? no, we are definitely going to share just a few. Just a few. Couple. And then keep the rest. And <laughs> we're greedy. <laughs> no, we see we, we trying to play some Pokemon online. Come I mean, on. that's, I, we're greedy, right? Let's just be honest. All right, so let's do this. Um, Alolan Duck Trio is what we're gonna start off with, and I'm just gonna just just slowly go through. Um, hopefully you guys checked out the Darion's Pokemon early box, because if you didn't, go head over there and then come back and check this out. Um, that way we, you can see all the craziness that we did. We did and a we, much longer video. Uh, we did a huge video, and we explained some of the cards. This one, I think we're just going to just ease our way through it. You could also, I mean, you can, you can hit up some of the other trainers. If you right, want. right, like, right. I, I got I, When we get to the catcher, right? Ooh. ooh Tapu Bulu, we didn't get a Tapu Bulu. Not. Tapu Bulu is pretty. Um, all right. Yeah, the catcher I want to go over again, because my sure. mind is actually... Oh, wait, we're going to... I'm super impressed with the way they did in the new catcher. Mm -hmm. We um, can definitely talk about some trainers. What is it called? Is it it's not twin catcher? What what is it called now? Custom catcher. Is it custom catcher? Yes. It's really good. All right, we also need to keep an eye out for. So we found one that did the new. Uh, we found March. two. Lost well, March. Damn it, nay two. Okay, the lost March ability. Yes. With those of you who do not know, this is the night March ability, basically. The Lost Zone is now back. I guess Mikey can explain yeah, all yeah. that to you as well. And we didn't know that this one did it. We know Jump Luff does it. Yeah. So we need to keep an eye out for any other one that has the Lost March ability. I'm assuming it's going to cost one DCE for everyone because Night March didn't change it up at all, right? They're well, all no, there was one that had the same cost, three right? colorless. Three colorless? Yes. Um, Instead of being like the psychic or whatever? Correct. Pumpkaboo okay. had three colorless, but you could play the stadium that right. let it reduce. So. Oh, got it. So how many fairy charms oh. do two men need? I know, there were so There's many fairy charms. Tapu Fini. You can stay right there. All right, uh, you, you go ahead You go. Ahead and you go. can read that custom catcher. All right, custom catcher. This is the perfect way. So Pokemon Catcher has two versions of it. The old version, which just simply said, hey, you play this, switch to their active with one of their benched. That was way too broken. They changed it to flipping a coin. If you win the flip... It's, well, obviously, if you get heads, which is winning the flip in Pokemon, mm -hmm. you get to do it. Tails, uh, you don't. And it made it eh, not that good. Mm -hmm. This one, I think, is a perfect balance on how to do it. You can play two custom catchers. I won't go too high up. You get blurry. <laughs> at once. If you only played one, draw until you have three cards in your hand. Great. That's awesome. Card drawing power. If you played two of them, then you switch your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active Pokemon. No flipping involved. To me, that is the perfect way it, of balancing Pokemon Catcher. I agree. I really agree. And our rare is going to be... Kofagarigigurgus. Kofagigigus. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I can't say it. You can't say Did it. None it? of Did us can say it. Yeah. It's Kofagarigus? It's, it's like coffin type thing. Yeah, I know. Kofagarigus. Whoa, are you going twice in a row, buddy? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just kidding. I'm just no, no, kidding. you're I'm good. Kidding. You're I'm good. Kidding. I'm, kidding. I'm, kidding. I'm, I'm just trying I to have... just do stuff. Uh, either a Prism Star or an Ultra Rare. Ooh. Prism Stars I don't count as Ultra Rares. They're half point hitters. They're kind of like breaks to me. Shh, no, you can't. See. You can say that, but that's not 100% true. Like every pack, there's like a fairy charm. Wait and see. see. Hammer. <laughs> now that is just, I'm not, mm, that is a hot mess. You can only use this if you go second and on your first turn. Ooh, there's an Espeon. And something nice. Septile! Oh my gosh, read that Septile. He's pretty beautiful too. All right, all right, all right, fine. For one, you do 60 damage. Discard a special energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. Hey, we were talking about right? discarding some special energy. It is a stage two, however. Leave Cyclone for two. Move a grass energy from this Pokemon to one of your bench Pokemon. So if it gets knocked out, 
You don't care because you have one more energy on your bench. Level 130. And Jungle Heal, your GX ability for one. Heal all damage from each of your Pokemon that has... Ooh, you know how crafty that is? That have any of the energy attack? I mm -hmm. see what they did there. Yep, yep. Oh, I just dropped your stuff pile. Oh, it's okay. It landed just fine. It's okay. We'll just put him in sleeve and it'll be fine. You're good. You're good. All right, it's your turn. Go. All right. I want to read this Espeon. Oh, I had this Espeon. Espeon has four colorless allure. It does draw three cards. You like, I like that. Baby Carl. And then we have, uh, for one psychic, we have Energy Crush. It's kind of hard to read out on the hollow. It does 20 plus. This attack does 20 more damage for 20 more damage times the amount of energy cards attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. Hmm. Does that ability sound familiar? <laughs> that ability is like <clears throat> everywhere. And now it's my turn. Don't open my pack. It's my turn. <laughs> yeah. My bad. I tried. I tried. Is that a white code? It is a, is white, that a white code. code? It's a white code. I also saw that prism star. Oh, there's a prism star? I don't know if it's prism or if it's ultra. I don't know. I think we'll it's see. prism. All it right. Look, it looked very silverish. <laughs> fairy <laughs> charm. Yeah, the right. third fairy charm. Third one. Shuckle. Shuckle's good. Fresh squeeze. You can search your discard, uh, search your deck for three uh, energies and discard them. So you can use that with Rayquaza. So I got whooped by it it's from Japanese <laughs> people in, at Worlds this year. <laughs> it was very, very interesting. I was very, very sad. And our ooh, Tyranitar. Tyranitar. Is there any idea how many words are on that card? There's so Look many. Look at how oh many gosh. words are on that and card. I have to read it. Oh my god! Yeah, I'm glad right. you do. Let's let's do this. All right, for, <laughs> he has 250 <laughs> hit points. He is dark. He has his ability is called Lost Out. Let me try to stable. There we go. If your opponent's Pokemon is knocked out by damage from this Pokemon's attack. Put a Pokemon. Oh my gosh! You're, did you just swallow a fly? Hmm? Little no, Carl it's over there. It's over there. Carl Jr. Okay. is over there. He tried to. He, he tried to flee. He, he landed on my lip. And I got a little. <laughs> I got a little scared. All right. You got this, Mikey. All right. You have a novel Come to on. read. All right. Let's see. We'll just read it over. If your opponent's a Pokemon was knocked out by damage from this Pokemon's attack. Put that Pokemon and all cards attached to it in the Lost Zone instead of the discard pile. Nice. And then we have Dusty Ruckus for 130 <laughs> for two darks and a colorless or half a DCE. Yeah, yeah. This attack does 30 damage to each of your opponent's bench Ooh, that's Pokemon. Good. That's bench really basic good. Pokemon. Okay. And then we have his GX attack called Lay the Smackdown on oh my you. God. Oh Lay my it the Smackdown for 220. Two DCs and a half of, I mean, two DCs, Whoa. two dark energies and a half a DCE. This attack, the this attack's damage isn't affected by any other effects on your opponent's active Pokemon. I want to point out something nice. that everybody is thinking. That thing kills every Magikarp in play. It does. Exactly. And it goes to the Lost Zone, and then you use <laughs> Lost March. Yeah, there you go. That's <laughs> there you go. yeah, yeah. Uh, well, I guess it doesn't kill every Magikarp in play. Not your Magikarp. Not your Magikarp. It's, it's not like, uh, oh my god, was it Seismato that just threw damage to everybody? Everybody took 10, or what the heck was it? What? Who threw damage to, like, everybody? It was, there was a Gorkice that put two damage counters on each of your opponent's Pokemon. Tyranitar, the old Tyranitar did that. The oh fourth? my gosh. Is that's that a playset? Like, I think already a playset. That is ridiculous. <gasps> Oh, that's the skip zone. It's still really good. <laughs> it searches for the jump off. Yeah. The jump off that we seemingly cannot find. What does this one say? Sheninja? I don't know. When a reverse hollow like psychic is impossible to read. Correct. See, if you tilt it up like that, it's actually easier to read. Oh, yeah. If you tilt it away from you. All right. Once during your turn before you attack, you may discard all cards attached to this Pokemon and attach to one of your Pokemon as a Pokemon tool card. When spoke what little wow wow. When the Pokemon this card is attached to is knocked out, your opponent takes one fewer prize card. Ooh. That's pretty good. Are you sorting this at all? Yeah, I, I, you got your here. stack of EVs and EV evolutions. <laughs> up here. All right, you know what? I'll do it down here. I'll just. All right. Sounds good. <laughs> sounds good. Let me go ahead and pull out the fairy charms. <laughs> pull out the fairy <laughs> charms. Out the fairy charms. <laughs> To you, a fairy do your thing, count. sir. I'm just doing right. over here. <laughs> that is hilarious. We have a. Ooh, I see some shininess. Hop it. Picky pack. Slugma. There's a Macargo GX in this set, too. Is it Macargo? 
Ooh, Thunder Mountain. Thunder Mountain. We saw this one. Thunder. This one's actually really cool. And we have, ooh, ooh Genesect. 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 All right. I'll read this Genesect. It says, it has 180 hit points, it's metal, and its ability is called Double Drive. You know the way you were doing that? It sounded like you were doing a game. Like, you guess this. You're like, it has 100 HP, it's basic, it's metal. You know, you're saying it the way, like, I gotta guess something. Oh. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> like, hey, go on. <laughs> <laughs> this Pokemon might have up to two Pokemon tool cards attached to it. If it loses this ability, discard a ta uh, Pokemon tool from it and only have one remain. Okay. I'll Not leave. too bad. That seems kind of, again, redundant to explain. If it loses the ability. <laughs> so, yeah, clearly if it loses the ability. Well, you have to. If you remember that there's kids that are playing okay. that are like well, six a, years old. A board state check, so, though. You know, the game's you know, always I checking the board so. state. I guess I'm so. sorry. I'm getting too technical. Too technical. Don't yell at me. Two metal energies, <laughs> one, uh, well, half a DCE, burst shot for 130, and then we have Break Buster GX for 190 for two metal and a half a DCE. Yeah, I'm yeah. trying to get used to that. I love that. Uh, this attack damage isn't affected by resistance. Okay. All right, so you just hit it for 190 and be good. There's a lot of better GX abilities oh, out there. Oh, there are, man. yeah. But having two uh, Pokemon tool cards attached to it is pretty legit. Oh, no, that's pretty huge. Anytime you've been able to do that in the past. Because you can use tool draft with him. It's always been pretty huge. Oh, my, okay, my, my bulk stuff. So I'm sorry. I'm in your way, my game. I was just trying to sleep. I'm in your guys. way. I'm sorry. Trying to sleep cards. You're good. And, ooh, I have two back to back ninja ass. Ooh, look at that. Oh, oh my god. He lives. Look at his beard. Look at that beard. Look at that icicle beard and the fluffy, sharp, pointy, fluffy butt tail thingy. Tail butt. Tail butt. He's got a tail butt. <laughs> <laughs> So, I'm sorry, that art is great. It's, I like it. He's just like, <laughs> he just, just strolling. Look at his expression. He's like, so what? So, I got icicles for a beard, and I got a spiky icicle fluffy mostly, tail. I, I think only times I've ever seen a bear tech art, <laughs> and he's on his, his two hind legs. So I never knew he just like randomly just strolls on all four. I know he's a polar bear, and it does that, but... <laughs> I'm yawning. I ran out of oxygen from giggling over here. <laughs> it's so cute. I actually really like that art. <laughs> His expression's like, Max, like, what? Mm -hmm. What are you going to make? What? What? Was that three? Was that three ninja asks? I No, I put it behind. I put it behind. I'm an idiot. Okay. I was just, <laughs> I was just losing my mind over that. <laughs> For a bear tech. Bird tech. Everyone right. don't mind me. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> I don't blame you. Why do I all find right. this so amusing? Uh, I'll share though. another code at this time. Oof. You can have one now. Thanks, dude. All right. <laughs> and put that there because that's the energy. We have Morty. There's a carping. Shenotic. Larvitar Pachirisu. I like it. Hobbit. Why haven't we pulled a jump bluff yet? That's what They're going to be $12 a piece. <laughs> right? Lapras. He has one that says, let's go swim. Mm -hmm. All right, go for a swim. I like an Entei. Oh my gosh, look at that art on that Entei. Uh, I can almost tell what's going on in that picture. Kind of. Everything is like, blurring everything together. Is going, everything's going on in that <laughs> it's picture. It's a very busy picture. All right, you give him a code. I can give him a code. Yep. Giving away Mikey's code. Boom. Ha 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 ha. Skidoo. Uh, Onyx old school. I love that art. That type of art. That's old school Ralts art, art too, as it, well. The claymation kind of thing. They have a couple claymations, but yeah, it's really cool. Yeah, that's I love the claymation. Very throwbacky there for Ralts. We oh, got this yet? I have not. Did we even get it? No. And this is a Kali. Moo Moo Milk. With the, moo Moo they Milk. They reprinted Moo Moo Milk. Choose one of your Pokemon, then flip two coins. For each heads, heal 30 damage from that Pokemon. Moo, moo, milk. I moo. love that. And Naganadel. And then we have draw two cards, then flip a coin. If heads, if you played this uh, Kali, car, uh, Kali from your hand, put it... Wait. <laughs> if you played this... That says Kali, right? Kali? I... I mean, you're just, Kylie? you're just, you're just, you're Kylie. just thriving. You have to say, you're really uh, driving home that L. It's not there. Oh, I am. It's, it's <laughs> Kylie. It's Kylie, not Kylie. 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 Yeah, Kylie. 
Kaylee. I'm getting Kaylee. lightheaded from Kaylee. Googling. Kaylee, Kaylee, Kaylee. I don't know. It doesn't matter. But it says draw two cards, then flip a coin if heads. If you played this Kylie card from your hand, put this card into your hand. Set of the discard pile. Bounce it back. Okay. If you have no cards in your deck, you can't play this card. <laughs> right. But I just don't understand. Well, I, is there cards that you play from? Okay, draw two cards. Can you play? Then flip a coin. If you played this from your hand, put this into your hand instead of this. If you played this from your hand. I'm, is there any cards? I don't know if you could play. Like so When you, you go play? to play a card, okay, in Pokemon, right? Yeah. So when I say I'm playing this, I, I put it down. Yeah. I do the effects. When the effects are all done, then it moves to the discard pile. Discard yeah. pile. It doesn't immediately go to discard pile. No, it does. So it does. It does now. It does now? It yeah. goes in. It, so it doesn't sit there? No, nope, it goes to the discard pile now. Right. Okay, so I wonder if that has... If you played this from your hand. So you would play it, but that doesn't matter for the played part. Right, and that's what the issue I'm having with. Okay. Like, is there any Pokemon that say, play a supporter from your deck? Well, what about from your or play, discard pile? Or play a supporter from your discard pile? So wait, if you had a question then. So in theory, right, you have a discard pile. Right. If you played something from your discard pile, it will go, most things say, put it, like, like if you play a trainer card, you, you play the trainer card first. You pick it up, and then you can play it. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, if there's, if it's in a state where now it immediately goes to the discard pile, then when, for game state, how does it happen? If you play it from here, it doesn't go, like, onto effect and then come back, does it? Or does it just never move? The effect just kind of happens. Does that make sense? Do you see what I'm trying to say? Because, like I said, kind of like before, your cards would, it would sit there, yeah. resolve... And then go and then to move. the discard pile. So if you played it from your discard pile, it would technically move out, resolve, and then move back. But if it immediately goes there now, if you technically played something from the yard, does it go to a different zone while it's resolving? No, it just... so It just kind of so, triggers from the yard. So I think it triggers as... So you're like, I'm playing this, and then it triggers. So and if it's in there, there, it just kind of goes... Whoop, right. <laughs> and plays itself. And so you're just like... Whoop. Yeah, I'm like, that's kind of... But you played it from your hand, so it would go back to your hand. Well, yeah, no, is, it's just going. Is, but that was just confusing Man, I did, me for a second. I just added twenty minutes onto this video. Oh, it's all I good. still don't understand this. Let me see this while you're opening. <laughs> it's all good. If you played this one. Okay, if you played this Cali from your hand, put this. Oh, oh God, I'm an idiot. Okay, I think it, it might. Is it a game state thing? Okay, so let's say I have two of them, right? These are mm -hmm. two the same. And this one's in the yard, and I play this one. The yard, sorry. Mm -hmm. I always call it a yard. Right. And I play this one. You can't return this one. Oh, okay, that makes sense. I think that's all it's saying. It sounds, we're, we're, we're overthinking it. Okay. There's a lot of redundancies now in the way that they're explaining cards, right? When I'm right. like, you don't need to explain that because it's, it's a given. Right, right. I think it's the same thing with this. We're just It's a given it. if you play this card, this card comes back. They're trying not to break the game state by saying, I play this, but I want this one back. It makes no difference to the game at all, but I think that's why it's saying, if you played this, Callie, mm -hmm. from your hand, put this card into your hand. And, like I, I, Okay. That's my guess. I think it's just they're trying to clarify for any future like rulings. So, like right. you as a judge, for example, if I play this and I go, all right, I'll just take one back, you're like, no, 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 that's illegal. Well, technically, you, you need must to take this that. one yeah. back. Does it matter? I don't mm. think so off the top of my head. Maybe if it's a full art, they were like, I just want to return this full art. You may maybe. maybe, so... I don't, I don't know. know. I don't, I don't know. know. Sorry, everybody. This video is not much longer than it should have been. It's okay. <laughs> I love this little special, like, backgrounds they have. The Poplio has... Yarn. Well, this one has balls of yarn. The Poplio has, like, little candies. Like, little heart candies. It's really cool. Secret Alleyway. <laughs> I just read do you see that secret alleyway huh. if you have any fairy Pokemon in play this Pokemon has no retreat cost okay and we have mm. a shiny card in here sneaks into the secret Gardevoir alleyway. and we have a Verizian or Verizon Verizian I call it Verizian but on the anime it was called like Verizian I don't like that it's, it's Verizian right <laughs> I don't care what you say it's Verizian <laughs> right <laughs> change my mind alright so, ooh, he has 170 hit points. He's a grass type. It does sound like I'm asking a question. Doesn't it? Doesn't it? <laughs> for one colorless, double draw. Draw two cards. And then sensitive blade for two 
uh, grass for 50 plus. If you play a supporter from your hand during your during this turn, it does 80 more damage. Nice. And then we have Breezeway. Breeze away. I'm sorry. It is. I'm just mm, getting tired, buddy. English is hard, and then I'm tired. Pretty this weekend. It is. It's always a long weekend. Right. A colorless for this attack. Put any number of your opponent of your Pokemon in play, and all cards attached to it into your hand. That is pretty slick. So if you're about to knock, get knocked out, you just. Why do I feel like you've opened like three packs in a row? I don't know. Did I open three packs though? We might just be going that slow. <laughs> That's probably. We're, we're it. going. Stupid I slow. thought we were supposed to go faster in this box than we did on that first one. But I mean, honestly, we should probably Lost like... March. Once we get like halfway <laughs> through, we should probably, you know, like a couple more packs. Just rip it and go. We're we're like 20 minutes deep, right? I don't know. Are we? Maybe. Maybe? It's up to you. It's your channel, buddy. No, you're good. So it's, it's up to your channel. I'm sorry, everyone. We're in my studio, so it feels like it's kind of like my video. <laughs> I keep for forgetting that... But this is actually... This is Mikey's. This is the first time you've actually been on my channel. I'm such a slacker. You don't need to remind me of that. I know, Mikey. It's I good know. to I'm just kidding, It's buddy. good to have you on the channel. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hi, Dr. Nick. I'll be around time to time. Don't right. worry. All right. Here we go. I don't know. I think we can just run right, right. up a little bit more. You just going to go like that? Sure, Lost Blender and Sloking. All right, we'll exhaust our arms. Let's do it that way. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Get the coat off this way. I don't want you to see if it's green or white because that ruins the suspense. And probably the fact that I just, like, flashed the back few cards. Whoa, Magirna. Magirna. I didn't even read that one. Search your deck for two basic... Energy Whoa. Pass. Okay, yeah. So, search your deck... For up to two basic energies, reveal them and put them into your hand. Shelf your deck. Always a good thing to have. And then the energy press is tacked to 20, 20 more damage times the amount of energy attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. Mm, that's pretty strong on a basic, man. We've seen this a couple times, though. A few times. I'm saying that's, <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty yeah, strong yeah, for a basic. You're not wrong. Oh, ditto. Oh, my gosh. Ditto. This one's so good. Ditto. Recap. And that is not a half a point right there. Half point hitter? Uh -uh. Okay, this ditto is... Absolutely amazing. Come on. Almighty Evolution. Once during your turn before you attack, you may put any stage one card from your hand onto this Pokemon to evolve it. You can't use this ability during your first turn or the turn this Pokemon is put into play. It's anything. It's anything you want. Yeah. It's 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 what Ditto it has always ditto been meant to be. Should have been. Yeah. All exactly. the Ditto cards should have been this. Oh, it's Ditto pretending to be any Pokemon. Right. Oh, that kind of fits the theme. Hide that code, because I don't want to give away all the good stuff. Oh, Mikey's being greedy. No, I'm talking about I don't want to give I'm, away I'm if, kidding, it's I'm a, kidding, I'm kidding. if it's a really good <laughs> card or not. All right. Shuckle's a really good card. There's two Mareeps in this set. Two Mareeps. Poipo. Poipo. Oh, that's Ooh, sick. Oh, that is a pretty card. All right. So we have Whitney here, and it says, draw a card. And then draw two cards for each other Whitney card in your discard pile. That is really cool. I love this art. That is really pute, uh, cute. <laughs> I don't know. It's what, very pute. Cute, pute. That is very, <laughs> very pute. I was probably probably trying to say pure, pretty. You were trying to say PewDiePie. PewDiePie. Uh oh, we just name dropped him. We're gonna get in trouble now, so, Mikey. No, no, it's all good. I thought you and PewDiePie. Do you still have that beef with him? We don't have a beef. Oh, you got over it? What? You two what? aren't mad at each other anymore? Why? Why would he... This Stop guy knows it. PewDiePie. Stop it. He knows him. I do not know PewDiePie. No, he had to DQ PewDiePie once during a tournament, and like, it, <laughs> oh, it got out of hand quick. <laughs> Someday you should tell him the story, Mikey. <laughs> when? You know what? Whenever you want. It's your channel, man. <laughs> <laughs> do you see that? I just switched it up. All right. I think it would just be faster, right? right. All right, so we're not going to do it as fast as I normally do it. Correct. We're going to do the happy mediums Correct. speed. And now I don't have to worry about the code as much. Right. Oh, man, I'm, I'm bad at happy medium. I'm so sorry. Moo moo milk. Moo milk. <laughs> all right. See, you, all right, everyone, let me tell you exactly what Mikey's doing right now. He's weaseling out. He's trying to hurry up and get through these packs now so he doesn't have to tell you the PewDiePie story. <gasps> no. <laughs> That's exactly what's no, happening. There is right? no PewDiePie story. Nihiligo. Look at that. Oh, Nightcap. 
<laughs> what? As an attack night, nightcap. Mike keeps losing his mind. It says nightcap. You can use this attack only if your Pokemon or your po your. Po I'm done. You can use this attack only if your opponent has exactly two prize cards remaining. Choose one of your opponent's Pokemon attacks and use it as this attack. Do you see this Kecleon? He has unit energy three. As I know. long as this Pokemon has unit energy attached to it. It has to have this unit energy attached to it. It is considered these three Pokemon. I know. Types. That's, it's, it hurts your brain to, to figure that all out. <laughs> Fortress. So why are they trying to confuse these poor kids? I don't know. It's at confusing the tournaments. as well. Oh, speaking of tournaments. So I hear you had a DQ PewDiePie. Want to tell us what it's all about? What are you talking about? I've never had to DQ PewDiePie. I don't think he's ever played Pokemon. Did you in hear his how life. Mikey just stumbled on that? He's like, I never had to DQ P PewDiePie. He can't even say his name anymore. Oh my gosh, calm he's down. Still, calm he's still sensitive down. about it, everybody. I'm not sensitive about it at all. Oh, you're not sensitive? So he admits it happened. Do you hear that? I he just said he's no longer sensitive about it. It means it happened. Oh gosh. Moltres. Moltres. That's the first time we said Moltres. Charm. And oh, more fairy it's charms. Not nothing special. Okay. I'm gonna promise you that one, buddy. <laughs> All right, we have a picky pap coming up in the front here. <laughs> I don't know what that. Was. Oh, Victini. That's a Victini. Oh, look man. at that art. It looks hand drawn. That is really cute. He's falling out of the sky, but he's really happy about it for some reason. And he's about to give you a V beat down. Is there an yes? Did, did we already open one of these? We did. Uh, we opened one on the other channel. Oh, okay. I was <laughs> like, wait a second. Did you get two Xerneas? <laughs> on your channel, we opened it up. Man. You got a Xerneas on your channel. So, well, you got one on your channel now. Yay. We got a did on your channel, too. We did, we did do that. <laughs> if you didn't go check it out, you can check it out after this video now. <laughs> Hashtag spoilers. <laughs> Hashtag spoilers. <laughs> it's your oh, it's my turn. Yay. Spoiler one. <laughs> All right. Here we go. What's wrong with us? I don't know. Oh, here's the new. You on can the read unknown. It. Oh, read this it. thing it's, is. That one's really good, too. Oh, this is amazing. Wait. Wait. Unknown damage. What? No, this is different. I know, it's a different one. Read it. Its ability is just called damage. Yes. That is amazing. Yeah. That's a sweet ability. Okay. Read it. Once during your turn, if this Pokemon is your active Pokemon and there are, excuse me, 66 or more damage counters on... Hold on. Please wait. Once during your turn, before you attack, <laughs> if this Pokemon is your active Pokemon... Got it. I'm with you so far, card. And if there are 66 or more damage counters on your bench Pokemon, you may use this ability. If you do, you win this game. It doesn't say the game either. It's this game. Yeah. Where's the other one? Does it say this game it or the game? It says this game. That's weird. Okay. 66 or more damage counters. That's 160 damage spread out between your Pokemon. That is... How do you plan for that? <laughs> well, I don't. Well, lords, I don't know. <laughs> like, not even absorbing it, but how do you just like? You know, I don't want to get this much damage everywhere. Wishy washies. You just. You have to like. They have to be very close to being knocked out. Yeah, because I'm like, remember the Magikarp deck? Mm -hmm. You throw twenty damage counters in right. every single thing you have. You know, whatever. But I'm mean, even then. I'm like, that's. That was a deck that tried to put damage on your own stuff. So that's. That's cool. I like I, flavor wise. That's right. amazing. Oh, 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 huh? It's very. I don't know how it's gonna work. I yeah, heard it's not. I heard, but I heard unknown deck did well in Japan. It was the unknown. But was it this? I don't unknown? know if it was this one. The other unknowns sick. There's there's three of them. I think three or four of them that has that kind of thing. What? There's one that I think is called Hand. Three or four of them. Yeah. Okay, where's the other one we have? We we have the we have the damaged and we have the other one. I can find it real quick. It was an uncommon, so Oh, you could have told me that before I grabbed the stack of rares like an idiot. Mm-hmm. Nice fairy charm. Was it at a hollow though? I man, I don't know. I'll open up another pack while you No, trying. you know what? No, that'll take my turn. Right. How dare you, Mikey? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You just look like you were happy just searching for these cards. I am happy to search for these cards. What am I doing? I'm opening a Steelix. That's all I'm in. Moo Moo Milk. Moo Moo Milk. All right. And I have Poplio. You see the little candies? That's adorable. And a Chandelure. Chandelure. I'm going to swing from the Chandelure. 
Yeah, look, I have four packs left. You have three, but you probably opened first. Because I just I opened first. <laughs> calm down. Now look. No, I will not three. calm down. You have three now. Dust ox, snubble, uh, and that's that's it. Zatu. That's all I got. You know what? We haven't pulled. I thought you were about to be like, you know what? We're gonna fight. I don't know why, but that's where I. I'm like, don't PewDiePie me, dude. <laughs> Okay. Seriously, you gotta hear the story. Oh, Alright, go ahead. Stop it. <laughs> not to. We have not pulled a single jump luff yet. Yeah, it's $12. That, hashtag is, card. Will, that is going to be an expensive card. Or we're just highly unlucky. Or we pulled like four of them and we're just dumb Top and we haven't lele. noticed. Hey, lele. What does the Lele do? Let's look at it. Charmed Charm. Oh my gosh. Do you see? Look at the foil in the camera. That is beautiful. I mean, it's a Lele. Look how majestic it is. Feel, right? Whenever you attach a Pokemon tool card that has Fairy Charm in its name, <laughs> well, we got a few of those. <laughs> uh, to, from your hand to this Pokemon during a turn, you may leave your opponent's active Pokemon confused. I'm confused at how many cards we pulled. I'm confused on what this card even does. I don't even care. Read it. I didn't uh, read it last time. It's really bad. All right. <laughs> Here go. <laughs> it's really bad. It's moving on. Not that great. Alright, we have... Oh, there we go! Oh, hand! So it's damage, hand, and, what's the other one? And then the other one is called missing. Remember? Missing damage, hand, mm -hmm. hand missing damage. Come on, man, let's make some sense out of this. Mm -hmm. Um, Hand. Once during a turn before you attack, this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, and you have 35 or more cards in your hand. <laughs> If you have 35 or more cards in your hand, you can go ahead and just win the game. If you have 35 or more, if you have 60% yep. of your starting deck in your hand, you yep. can go ahead and just win the game. Yep. I can't right now. I just can't. It's all, it's good. It happens. I just I think it was hand that actually won the, the Pokemon uh, the Japanese tournament. It happens. You just happen to use just casually have thirty five cards. I don't. I don't know hand. how you do it though. I was trying to. I've been trying to think about how. How, how, how do you draw? Okay, so this, how do you draw this one here, where you draw, draw, then draw two cards for each other, waiting you discard pile. That's not getting you to thirty two on its own, nope, buddy. It isn't, but. I mean, you're doing all right. So draw a card for each other. Whitney. So you're like, all right, I'll draw six and I'll draw four. So that's Seven. ten. So that's twelve. Well, no, I'm saying off the Whitney. Oh, okay. Well, so you're drawing twelve on your four. Off your. So you draw Whitney. a card at first. Yeah, but I'm saying, okay. So you play your first one. Mm -hmm. You're getting one card, right? So you're getting zero on the second. Ability. Oh, okay. So then you're gaining two, mm -hmm. and then four, and then six. So you're getting twelve. You're gaining sixteen total cards from Whitney, and then, but it's replacing itself though. So like. You're, you're, you're netting 12 mm -hmm. is your, your grossing 16, netting 12. Uh, that's still on a full hand. You're not there yet. Anywhere near that. I don't know. You're looking at 19 if you didn't play any of the Thing is, is you, you can't. It's a supporter. If it's expanded, though, you can use PS Seekers. <laughs> so you can oh. just dump all four of them in your... Oh. <laughs> you have to dump, but yeah, it's it's supporter level, so you can't play Whitney, 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 Whitney on right. in one turn, because you have to. Well, that doesn't work either because you play Whitney, Whitney, and <laughs> yeah, and exactly. Expand it, Whitney, Whitney, Judge. Someone's I gonna be like, God, oh, Judge, get get your thirty four cards out of here. I don't know that. I'm just confused about that. Man, this was supposed to be the shorter video. <laughs> it's okay. BT Dubs. <laughs> BT Dubs. Oh yeah, you can yeah, do that one. Yeah, I'm happy yeah. about this. I opened that on. Uh, we it. have Mimikyu GX here. So 170 good. hit points is a fairy Pokemon. We have Perplex for a fairy energy. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now confused. And then for a fairy and a half a DCE, we have Lust Snuggle and Fall for 10 plus. This attack does 30 more for uh, damage for each damage counter on your opponent's active Pokemon. And then we have. Dream Fear GX for a fairy. Choose one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Your opponent shuffles that Pokemon and all cards attached to it into their deck. I like it. I like it. I'm just glad that Mimikyu's getting some love. I know. He's adorable. He should he should have got love a long time ago. Uh agreed. Agreed. He's played he was played a few times and it was copycat, but 
not a lot of people played them. Here's the Eevee. And then we have a Life Force. A Life which Force. One is, which life one's this forest. one? Oh, it's damage. And another Fairy Charm. Hand damage. Hand damage and uh, missing. We're, we're missing one. We're missing missing. <laughs> we're missing missing. And said, Jump Luffs. We haven't even gotten jump, any Jump Luffs. This is weird. Did they forget to print Jump Luff in this deck? Oh, that'd be great if it was just a troll. That would be great. Oh, this is new. Read it. I don't want to read it. Okay. I'll read I didn't it. get a Jump Luff. I'm going home. This set is huge, though. Oh, this is the biggest set they've done, done. isn't it? Yeah. 214, 214 cards. cards plus the secret rares. Exactly. Which, that is crazy. Who knows how many those are? They're up to <laughs> like 50 by now. <laughs> Jeez, it feels like that. Once during uh, each player's turn, that player may discard a fire energy card from the hand. If they do, draw three cards. Ooh, I like it. Ooh, draw three cards. Wait, yes. you going to get there? Read it. <laughs> A player may discard a fire energy from the hand. If they do, they draw three. Once, though, man. It's only once. During their turn. Man, that only gets us three cards. Two. Uh, that is cards. Two cards. You have a net mm -hmm. of two. So then you play... You play... Whitney? I don't know. I'm not... I don't know how I'm getting there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I did. I really did. Thank you so wait, much. Wait, there's a lot of basic Pokemon that allow you to fetch for uh, energy to put in your hand, right? Yeah. So go in, there's got to be things to put in your hand. There has to be cards. That, like, I'm sorry. Cards this is Mikey's channel. I won't take over it. I no, promise. You should ask him someday to tell you the PewDiePie uh, story. Okay, I love you all. Bye. Bye. <laughs>